Oh, you're here. I'm fine. No, I'm not. I'm not okay. But I'm taking one day at a time. I guess I've hit a bump in the road, huh? Your hugs always feel nice. It's time like these where I want them the most. Can we stand like this just for a few minutes? Please. Thanks. I don't even know where to start. I mean, there's so much going on these days. The world is going crazy. Our social lives have a lot more drama. Professionally, it seems hard to catch a break. The education system has changed. Certain family-related issues never seem to heal. And we still have our own problems. It's a lot to handle. It's just that. Sometimes I feel bad. Because I want to be that strong person for you and me. I want to be able to excel through every adversity without regret, fear, or pain. But the more life teaches me things and the more I grow, I'm learning that it's okay. It's okay not to be okay. It's okay not to feel 100%. Society expects us to keep moving, to be excited no matter the situation, to keep a smile on our faces, regardless of how painful our situations are. There are even times when we try to share our stories. Sometimes I don't feel understood. Because either that person can't relate to our story or due to a certain people or experiences, we develop a fear of rejection, gossip, ridicule. And no, it's not fair. And no, we don't deserve it. I get it. We're not always perfect. But regardless, it's really important to remember the sad feelings are just as important as the happy ones. And it's okay to recognize those feelings. It's okay to feel lonely, tired, confused, Anxious? Those are human emotions too. If we keep those emotions bottled up for too long, they'll still find their way out. But in a much more unpleasant way. 
We might lash out at a person who doesn't deserve it. We might make ourselves physically sick. It's not worth it. I'm not saying to get swallowed in woos. That's not productive either. We still need to push forward. But I think if we need a day or a week to step back and reevaluate, that's okay. If we need to disconnect for a minute, it's fine. If we need to cut some people off, it's okay. If we don't have to be in an unhealthy environment, don't do it. We might make a few people angry, but maybe the distance might do us some good. Besides, the ones that are meant to stay, the people that are truly on our side, will be ready to receive us. Not on their time, but when we are ready. I know this goes against that we're taught, but it's okay to stop forcing ourselves to please others. Because the person who will end up getting hurt the most will be us. You are worth more than that. So am I. Let's not lose ourselves. Okay? I know that was kind of deep and a little bit serious. But right now, I want to focus on myself. I need to. Besides, I can't be more help to others if I remember to give time and attention to myself. People are like batteries. They charge and deplete. It all depends on what they are being used for. Right now, I think I just need to recharge. I've let my battery drop for too long. I won't ask if it's okay. Because it's what I really need to do. I just hope the people around me respect that. But I do want you to know that I'm grateful to have you. I'm glad you are on my side. And I appreciate you being with me. I still love you very, very much. You know that, right? <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement. You too. Hang in there. We'll make it through this. Mm-hmm. Fighting. <laughs>